Yo guys, what is up? Today I'm going to be showing you how to make your own custom Netflix teleporter game. So you want to open up the RBXL or the Roblox place file. In the first link in the description should be a Mediafire link. Then you want to extract it to your desktop and then open the RBXL file. Then you should see it loading Studio. Logging in. There we go. I don't know why this is here. That's not normally here. It's okay there. That's gone. So, to edit the actual GUI, gotta go to inject. You want to disable these chat things, because they turn off your chat, and you don't want that. But this, like, instance code, this local, all the way from here... To here you replace so how do you do that well you get the plugin from the second link in the description then you want to just quickly make your GUI and I'll fast forward this part because it's easier and this isn't really crucial Okay, so I made the really simple GUI, as you can see, it's really simple. So now, you want to name the frame you put in, text box. You don't actually want to put in a text box, you want to name it text box. For the, um, syntax highlighting this uses. You could add your own, but I'm not going to show you how to do that in this video, because that's too much time. If you want to know how to add your own custom uh, uh, and syntax highlighting, then let me know. I'll do that. So anyways, here's your GUI. Make sure you name the mainframe exec. E X E C. Make sure you name the frame that you want to be the text box, text box. And then make sure you have a text button just called text button. So now what you want to do to the GUI is go to plugins and use that plugin that's in the second link in the description to hit GUI to Lua, then convert. So now you should be looking at this, right? Now you want to change starter GUI in here to player GUI. So it actually goes to the player GUI. So now you want to copy all this code, go back to that inject folder. Or that inject uh, local script, not folder, sorry. And... Replace the line of code that I have highlighted. Make sure you close out of that window first. And then, insert that. Then just check the stuff. Dip it should be good. It should be good to use... 
because now you want to delete or move your GUI in to wherever that isn't showing. And then you can publish this to Roblox and test it out. Note that the executor, if you're using the cheat engine variant, might crash a lot. Sorry, I had to do a quick water break. Anywho, thank you guys for watching. This is the end of the video. This is where you'd go up here, hit publish to Roblox, and name it whatever you want. And then be chilling. So yeah, that's all. Peace out. Goodbye.